Hey, what's going on? Philip Bay, it's All Access Sports here. Listen, it's football season. We've been waiting for it. The time is actually now. We're here live at the historic Baron Stadium watching the Rome Wolves as they are getting ready to do the first ever wolf walk across the bridge, getting ready to partake in their scrimmage against the Calhoun Yellow Jackets. Listen, it's time to get geared up. It's time to get ready. It's time to go All Access with your Rome Wolves. Well, let's waste no time and jump right into the action of the night. Colin Riley and the Calhoun Yellow Jacks waste no time getting on the board. Colin Riley throwing that ball up. Jump ball. You know what time it is. Touchdown by the Calhoun Yellow Jacks. Listen, the Calhoun Yellow Jacks are saying early on, we are real. Watch this. Coming back again, Colin Riley, the Mercer commit, throwing that ball down to the field, and it's a strike. You know what it is. I'm telling you. Touchdown all day long. But... The Rome Wolves will not say die. Rome Wolves kickoff return right now. Big one by the senior, TJ Stubbs, as he takes that ball down the left-hand side of the field. Has one guy to beat. Oops, yep, got him. TJ Stubbs takes it in. Touchdown. The freshman, Jemias Griffin. This guy right here is going to be a stud. He is called the future. Yes, that's right, the future, as he takes it on in for the score for the Rome Wolves. Listen, Rome keeping it close all day long, but not close enough. Colin Riley once again airing the ball out, looking like the, the, the old school Donovan McNabb, throwing that ball down there. Yet another touchdown by the Calhoun Yellow Jackets. Listen, Rome, they kept it close all night, not giving up making big runs, making nice plays, but at the end of the day, it was too much. Too much Calhoun. What was Calhoun? What? Well, all we can say is Calhoun was just Calhoun. Get ready, everybody. It's football season. It's all access time. <laughs> 